Right, welcome back. A quick little haul vid, I suppose you call it. Stuff that come in the post today, courtesy of a guy on Facebook. Most people know him in the community kit. That's what I'll say. Just in case he doesn't want uh, too much exposure. Especially when it comes to this item here all become clear because it's an unlicensed item. Uh, I've got two bodies of him. This one here with uh, ZC World I think it is. Nice figure. 26 quid delivered. Comes with this head sculpt which is got a likeness to Leonardo DiCaprio. Don't really want that. All I want is the, the body with the uh, muscle arms. I like a hard plastic there and then a softer rubber going down there, nice vein detailing. I'm only gonna, you're only going to be able to see about that much of the arm. Uh, I want to swap out the body on my Hicks figure, so I thought this would be an ideal body for it. It's got the neck, neck uh, connector there and I've got a sculpted neck on my figure, which I don't really want to cut down. So I've got that, and then just another basic body, cheapy body, but bloody good for the money. Uh, comes with the usual stuff, thigh thickness and neck plug adapter and a few hands. Two sets of wrist plugs, can't beat it for that price. This body here, come with a really nice uh, set of hands as you can see there. You've got two fisted hands, two hands like this for basically gripping the rifle or pulse rifle in this case, two relaxed hands and two trigger hands, one's on the body and they're really nice, really soft, pliable hands and they should grip the weapons pretty well. So for 26 quid with a head sculpt, the only thing needed really is another pair of wrist Oh, there goes one of the legs. Popped out. Um, easy to put back in, no probs. But uh, let me just show you this. The hands on this are really soft. And they pop. I don't know if I can do it. It's quite tight. But they do pop on and off with a little bit of help with a pair of pliers or something. They do pop on and off a lot easier than let me see if I can get it off I'm breaking it no, I ain't going to get a chance they do pop off really easy because they're like, so, like a softer rubber more squidgy than these hard really hard ones you have to sort of warm them up with hot water or hair dryer to get to get them off without breaking your wrist, wrist pegs so that's why they include an extra set. So let's remove all this rubbish out of the way. I will probably do a better video, higher quality, once I've uh, assembled this figure. You can see it's just a barrel. But uh, nice little emblem there. And this, of course, from Breaking Bad. Just want to do a little quick unboxing screw top. Uh, in there, you've got two sets of uh, shades which look really good. Um, I know compared to the Wolf King set, the shades are slightly different. Let's have a quick look. I haven't really looked at these. Yeah, those shades are much more accurate to water white. Those shades are really nice, translucent lenses, see through lenses, so I think that'll look really good on the head sculpt which I've already had a quick look at and it is really good. A couple of uh, loafers, boots, they're nice, nice detailed. I know the Wolf King set, I think they're a darker brown and if you watch the show he does 
have a, a few different pairs, different colours, so you can either paint those to whatever your preference. This mask is really nice. I'm not going to take all this stuff out. Um, really well done. Sculpted. Uh, not copied. This is a sculpt that was. If you're on Facebook, you can you can check these things out. I might put up some links. I'm gonna check with Kit first, see if he's all right with it. Nice sculpted gloves, sculpted trainers, soft soft rubber there, so it should pop in easy enough. I don't know if they're the right colour. I say easy painted. Uh, head sculpt. I will show that because I think it's. I mean, I think this camera's not very good, but. I think it's a good lightness. I know some people have called it Hestenberg. <laughs> um, I can see a lightness of Heston in there, mainly the ball head. I think it's a really good lightness for Brian Cranston. Uh, not 100%, I'd say it's about 90. But with the shades and the glasses on and uh, the um, ventilator, what do you call it? gas mask, ventilator. You also get a pair of socks. I had a look at this. Um, the apron is like a, a faux leather. Take it out, so I'm going to assemble it in a minute. So you've got a pair of socks basically just to sit over the uh, ankle pegs. Really nice quality chem suit, it's like a really light material, like a plasticky feel, and then a t-shirt, and that's it basically, and a nice faux leather apron, so for the money I think I paid for the two bodies and this set just under 100 quid. So, really, really happy with that. And I say, I've got a nice storage container to go over it all. So now I've just got to assemble it all. And I'll be back later with the uh, assembled figure. And maybe I'll swap out the body for on the Hicks figure. I don't know. That's a lot of work. A lot of intricate pieces on the uh, buckles and stuff. So I might leave that. I've got some other things that I'll come with come today and uh, oh, what amazing pieces a bit bittersweet because uh, the, pa the packaging was not up to much and uh, the box was damaged and stuff but luckily the contents are mint condition and I'm really happy with that so yeah back with high high definition or better definition than this and uh, might show off this head sculpt as well. It's really good, really good for basically a freebie. So, if there are any Leonardo bashes out there that you want to do, that might come in handy. Repair shades on. Yeah, not bad, not bad, not bad. <coughs> oh, great. Attack me, why don't you? Alright, I'm still alive. The dog's going crazy. I'm out of here. Take it easy.